Aha, here we go. Okay, you guys share screen. See if I can do a share screen too while I record. Sure. So Overwatch has been confirmed on the Switch. October fifteenth. Yeah. Wow. Of course it's gonna be. Good. I got so distracted yeah, just doing the screen sharing. <laughs> Hello everyone. I'll be your guide for today's Nintendo Direct. I'm Shinya Takahashi. People who like music. You gotta see these floors of the hotel for yourself. Luigi's Mansion, yeah. Luigi's Mansion 3 takes place in a haunted hotel. I gotta get every floor has a distinct theme unlike any other. Case in point, Tomb Suites. I mean, a pyramid inside a hotel? Guess we should expect some mummies, harsh sands, and booby traps. As for the other floors, the heck? Well, there's a disco floor, a pirate themed <laughs> restaurant, you get the idea. I want to see Luigi. May not be the video. usual amenities, <laughs> but there's a rogues gallery of bosses to check out before you, well, check out. Speaking of amenities, step right up to this all new attraction, Screen Park. In this party mode, there's a Luigi team and a Gooigi team. With Luigi. only one Nintendo Switch system, two to eight players Luigi. can battle it out. See which team can defeat the most ghosts. Collect the most coins by piloting floaties with the Poltergeist G00 and break the most targets. Hey, even Luigi needs a break sometimes. Luigi's Mansion 3 opens its doors on October 31st, just in time for Halloween. That makes sense. That really is Get a load of this new free to start Kirby oh, game. Cool. The combined new forces Kirby. of Kirby, mm. Kirby, Kirby, and mm. Kirby are in for some wicked Thank boss Kirby. fights. We're calling it Super Kirby Clash. Take up quests in town, and collectively, you and your team that will reminds me of a Kirby game on the Wii. To start Kirby? That's right. Get your weapons. Get your local wireless. Okay. Or even play online. Uh, it's one of those games where it's built to be free, but you have to pay for the online service. It'll be time to unite with friends and players from around the world. I mean, I get it, but... Each challenging quest when Super Kirby Clash launches later cool, today. At least. And remember, it's free to start, too. Oh, oh, that's oh, that's nice. This long-awaited, recently released RPG is getting a remake. Nice. After 25 years, fans nice. of the Mana series can look forward to the HD remake of the third game in the trilogy, Trials of Mana. 25 years. Step into the light, or show your dark side when picking your class to change your character's appearance and ability. Ah, interesting. Unlike the classic version, characters have full range of movement, that's including mechanic. jumping and combo attacks for each member of your party. Store for the beloved world of Trials nice. of Mana on April 24th. Next year. Seize every opportunity to protect your town in this new RPG from Game Freak. And almost all the music in the game was composed by Undertale creator Toby Fox. Undertale? Little Town Hero composed will make by a the stand on Nintendo Switch. October really? 16th. Yeah, he was. He's been working on music for and other games. And the game so later that makes sense. today. Wow. Who would have thought? He has more Fall is coming to Super Smash Brothers oh, Ultimate. Yeah! Smash! Smash! Yeah. Hey, Banjo! We confirmed the release date of Challenger Pack 3, Banjo and Kazooie. Release date confirmed. Let's go for it. And the release date is... Today. What? Today! After today's Nintendo Direct, we'll broadcast yeah. a video detailing... <laughs> Bring it on! Banjo and Kazooie. Featuring the game's yes. director, Masahiro Sakurai. Oh, As a special treat, the video will begin immediately following the Nintendo Direct you're watching right now. Oh, nice! To tide yourself over until the Sakurai release of Banjo and Kazooie, please check it out. There's Momo! But first. Uh oh. Uh oh. What's uh -oh. this? Uh -oh. What's this? Okay, turning back the time. Okay. Aha! Uh -huh. Neo Geo, baby. Oh, is it happening? Here we go. Is, is it happening? Is, is oh, that sound is so nostalgic to my ears. King of Fighters. 
it. It's Terry Bogard! Yeah, boy. It's time, Terry. Your dream's real. Oh, we all missed it. Looks like Joe and Andy <laughs> missed it. Boy. Sorry, man. Not, your, not for you. Geese? Oh! <laughs> Sorry, Geese. Back to Lulu. Oh, missed. <laughs> Obviously, the cards are not for you. The, the letters are not for you. It only belongs to one man. The poster boy of SNK. The one and only. Terry! Look at Vogard! I cover! <laughs> nice! It was yeah. obvious! Nice. Now in development. Yeah, boy. Stand up! Metal Fury. Can we get that, that uh, anime theme song of Terry Bogard's? From the movie? Oh, man. It was just play so. that. It was just Terry a no-brainer. From Fatal Fury is joining no. the battle. That it means we've revealed four sense. of the five fighters included in the fighters. Who's pass. next? Can there really be that? only one left? Oh, oh, oh boy! Whoa! This just in. More We're DLC happy to confirm the development? development of more DLC more? fighters for Super Smash Whoa, Brothers Ultimate. Really? Outside the five fighters included Whoa. in the fighters pass, we can confirm that other new fighters are in development. The battle isn't over yet. The battle's not over. There are gonna be more! Oh, oh, you can... So, what do you think? Oh. Regarding what was announced about additional fighters so at the end of that segment, we'll have more to share with you in the future. It's about time to wake the Windfish in The Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening, which means the next big adventure on Nintendo Switch is fast approaching. You'll meet some strangely endearing islanders, face a series of puzzling tasks, and encounter some oddly oh familiar God. faces. <laughs> Escape Koholint Island before its mysteries I've been get the best of, of it. Game Explainer is very faithful to the original. With the all new Chamber Dungeon, be ready. The Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening will launch before you know it on September 20th. The really? new Link amiibo figure will be available That's that really same cool. day. You know the hero's might from Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. Now join his adventure. <laughs> Dragon Quest XI S, Echoes of an Elusive Age Definitive Edition is exactly that. The day the game launches, free downloadable content wow. can be found in the Champions Pack, wow. including yeah. consumable yeah. items and more equipment that can change the appearance of party members. Oh, cool, you can, you can dress yourself near. up as the protagonist from 7. Dragon Quest XI S, Echoes of an Elusive Age Definitive Edition journeys onto Nintendo Switch September 27. These are so huge, I don't know where to start. I've, I've never really played like a, a Dragon Quest game. Until then, from beginning to you can end. prepare for your adventure with the free demo on Nintendo eShop. They're good. They're good games. Dragon Quest XI is probably the best one to go first for you. It'd be a great way to introduce yourself to the series. It's kind of like a passing in that goodness? way, I guess. Then say hello to Tokyo. The worlds of the Fire Emblem series and Atlas games have crossed paths, and the result is coming to Nintendo Switch. Huh. Oh, Tokyo! The story Rock takes session. place in oh, modern-day okay. Tokyo, where creative energy is so abundant it's materialized it's like, into something it's called like, uh, Performa, Fire Emblem, but like, uh, it's which Tokyo attracts Mirage, right? mirages who yeah, suck Tokyo it out Mirage of people. I've heard You'll of face off against this threat the as up-and-comer Itsuki Aoi and his friends hmm. who are trying to make it in the entertainment business. It plays like Fire Emblem. Fire Emblem characters like Prom and Sita will join you from another dimension. Together, you'll wage deep like, turn-based battles. Dan stands for the combat up. It's of the really Fire Emblem and Shin Megami Tensei series. And in the Nintendo so Switch version, there's a new Emblem song that, that wasn't included hmm. in the original. Kind of, kind of Be sure to check out the uh, other like new features, song. from the new story elements Sorry. to the characters joining you in battle for the first time. It's very fun. Hey, is that Tiki? Tokyo Mirage Sessions Sharp FE Encore releases on January 17th. You can pre-purchase the game later today. 
I'm still waiting to hear more, more about uh, Welcome back to where nothing is what it seems. The tense, Tensei series. Door that also takes us back I can't believe Badge is out now. 14 years ago. I can't believe Terry Bogart did it. Yeah, well, the attack was saying, true, though. The journey the attack was saying the rumor, that there was rumors the that Terry was going to be, be the next one. I'm actually really happy that Terry was the next one. What lies at the end? Will it be truth or madness? Deadly Premonition 2, a blessing in disguise. Deadly Bogart Premonition 2? <gasps> really? Deadly now, Premonition 2? You know that one? The original game in the series That's a classic the horror game. game. Deadly nice. Premonition Origins. It's a wow. Wow. That's awesome. That's Sin huge. The original Sin 2 Definitive Edition is finally coming. Ah, that's Nintendo awesome. Switch. That's Check actually really good too. Man, Nintendo's awesome. finally getting into gear. Hoarding most probably of the... getting their hands on RPGs that people want to play. I mean, talk about aggressive marketing. Look at that. They're porting this is, um... everything to the Switch. Even even this Overwatch is, a... is crazy. Probably. By the way, this is a really great game. Like, it's really, really good. It's, it's like playing like a, a narrative story where like all your decisions matter. Like, let's say you accidentally burn down a forest. Right. Well, maybe some soldiers come to kill you because you burned down their forest later on. <laughs> That's pretty good. That makes sense. That would be out today. Next. And now for a message from Bethesda. Bethesda. Oh boy. Hey Nintendo oh. fans, Pete Hines from Bethesda. Wait a minute. On behalf of that, 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 software, that's I'm excited awful. to announce something really cool that we have coming to Nintendo Switch later this year. It's awful. I'm sure many of you have fond memories of spending... Yeah, you can put my transactions in it, I guess. ...on Nintendo 64. Well, this year is the 25th anniversary of Doom, one of the most popular first-person shooter franchises ever. <gasps> oh so, like, my god! We is this Doom 64? Of our favorite games... Doom 60. Son of a Hogan! For the first time oh, since its original release in 1997, oh, 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 wow. Doom 64 will be officially available on a Nintendo console. It's a cult classic. Who would have thought? Demons and more than 30 action packs. For a minute there, I, I, I noticed the, 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 the logo newcomer, background when they were showing in the side. I was like, that looks that familiar. Helped Doom, one of the most <laughs> Holy crap. Franchises wow. Did they fix the lights? Please tell me they oh. fixed the lighting. <laughs> Well, it doesn't look as will release on Nintendo Switch. <laughs> is that a no this more? Who would have thought? Nice. Ouch. <laughs> nice. That's awesome. Introducing a Walk brand new IP from the best. High res studios. Oh, real deal. And as really? See, this is what I want in, that, in an actual, like, in a direct, in an E3. You know, for companies to bring their A game. We just want really good games, you know? We'll shed new oh, here we go. This next Pokemon here we go. Adventure. Please take a look. Pokemon Show Sword us. and Pokemon Shield take place in the Show Galar region, Scottish land. a scenic land where people and Pokemon wow. work together toward a prosperous future. Really Among good. them, like, you'll really encounter new good. Pokemon and meet new people throughout your adventure. This, this is the kind of Pokemon game people today, want to we'll cover four This is the kind of Pokemon game that people want to play to. for years. First, Being able to just go out and see your look. running around and all that stuff. Once again, the latest hey look, it's Scottish wife you pick your outfit. <laughs> Everyone really this likes time, lot. It's not just the tops and bottoms. fresh on this a one. wide variety, including Oh, I don't blame her. Well, she's like, she's a cutie. Yeah, people really like her as a character. But like, that, Plus, that's you that's can change your hairstyle. Or put on a little makeup. There's a lot that's a, more wow, that's a lot a of customization. Simply honing your battle skills. You've got to look the That's actually too, really great. Don't you think? They're they're really putting their all Second, in this one. Pokemon Camp. During your journey through the gallery, Pokemon region, Camp. You can camp anytime at Pokemon Camp. Pika. While you're there, you can play with your Pokemon. That's a new Pokemon. This is a new Pokemon. Better, they'll also improve in battle. Additionally, huh. in the wild area, you can visit other players' camps too. So go camping with your Pokemon? That's kind of cool. Feel free to bring along one of your Pokemon and so get to just relax and interact with stuff. There's my Tyra. Yes! We Tyra. definitely <laughs> recommend interacting Tyra, with Tyra, another player's there. Pokemon. Here's one of my chads. Third, curry on rice. Pokemon Camp is also a great place Lunchtime. to cook up a dish that is very popular in the gallery. Curry on rice. How your curry turns out 
And oh, so you can cook ultimately meals. Ultimately That's depends cool. on which berries and other Just don't overdo it with the curry. I, I probably don't digest curry very well. Into it. Yeah. It looks there like you get to finally make meals for your books. That's nice. And each one you cook up will be <clears> registered in your curry decks. The goal? To That's actually pretty cool. Art of curry. Huh? What's that Pokemon uh -oh. doing here? What's and that? First, we'll introduce some new Pokemon discovered in the <laughs> Gallery. Cool. First is Poltegeist. Body what, were they watching Alice in Wonderland when they saw this? its own aroma and flavor. It may even oh, allow God. a trusting trainer to taste its tea. This ghost type this Pokemon ditto. also has a special <laughs> ability called Weak. I like how he just pointed out the old Pokemon. Next, <laughs> I don't really care about the Pokemon new one. called Cramorant. Cramorant. This flying okay. and what water is, type Pokemon has a huge appetite. If it takes damage in this state, it'll retaliate by Congratulations, we have a new helmet. This is Cramorant's <laughs> exclusive new ability. Gulp missile. Is that a counter? <laughs> I don't even know. That's all we have to share with you today. Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield will launch on Nintendo Switch. November 15th. Uh, brace yourself for well, Black Friday. About that? There are still two more months. Oh, God. Yeah, that's right. Please Black look Friday's forward around to the day that time you can start. You We're looking to add in an additional library of games. It's called okay, Super, Nintendo, Super Nintendo, Nintendo, Nintendo Library. System, Nintendo Switch Online. With this... You can play a variety of classic Super NES games on Nintendo Switch. Okay. So you're playing pretty much the SAS. Some you may not expect. Nintendo Switch finally. Like stunt stunt reset effects, effects, huh? Wow. Which will be available to play on another system for the first time. Who would have thought? You can face off or team up. <laughs> it's literal, it's literal ROMs. It's <laughs> literal ROMs. Or even play together online. Oh, well, they have to fight piracy somehow, right? Oh. And the rewind function will yeah, be. Yeah, by hurting everybody else. Please, <laughs> Kinda. They look super ghouls and ghosts. Nice. Don't play Here that game. The first make you games we very bad. Trust me, I know. <laughs> I beat it. Knife. Get the knife. The hard way. All 20 of the games you yeah, see on screen will launch tomorrow. <laughs> you really do. It's awful. Of course, we will eventually add more. It's either the knife or get the crossbow. Oh, Demon's Crystal is Christmas Christmas in there too. Is exclusively available to Nintendo Switch Online members. So please enjoy them. At no Beat it too. Charge. I like Demon's Crystal. I, I like the, the thing that you I like Demon's Crystal. Oh, what's this? To recapture the original feel of these games, we will be. Oh, they're taking. The oh, they're. Uh, Nintendo Entertainment System. Nintendo I guess Switch they are uh, promoting the eight-bit controller. Has a special offer. That's gonna to be a special it, controller. You can use nice. A cable, just like the Nintendo Switch Pro Ooh. controller. Yeah, it's like an eight. The eight-bit Pretty much. It's got Bluetooth and stuff, which makes sense. Purchased exclusively for Nintendo Switch I'm online game. members. Not bad. Visit the Nintendo website. But it's pretty much just the eight-bit, but it's like the official. Yeah, it, it's more official now. Nice to play those games again with one of these. Controllers. Which is okay. Oh. Okay. Sure, Ooh, not for Tetris 99. You survive this? Nintendo Switch Online members. Survival mode. Scale puzzle battle game Tetris 99 is getting a free update. Tetris 99 Gosh, um, is here and not for the I channel part. play this. You can't even play it until you achieve the Tetris <laughs> maximum. Really status. salty while playing it. Can wow. you survive against the best of the best? Well, good luck. The version 2.0 update of okay. Tetris 99 will be available tomorrow. Nice. That's cool. Version, For tomorrow. Including That's pretty game, good. DLC, Physical and copy. Nintendo nice. Switch Online 12-month individual membership will be available September 6th. Ah, yeah. okay. It's not bad. Mario and Sonic are ready They're to kicking get it old school. school in Tokyo. Olympic Mario Games. Sonic at the Olympic Games has become a tradition. The Tokyo the Olympic Games. This time, there are more than 20 events. I like seeing Mario the 100 and, meter, and uh, karate, Sonic and uh, martial arts keys, by the way. Skateboarding, rugby sevens, sport climbing, badminton, gymnastics, surfing, and you know what? Who's Dr. Eggman? more where that came from. He's the best character. Check out these 10 retro They literally go old school, yeah. Each one rocking some sweet 2D style graphics. I don't know. I'm, I'm not really sold on the Peach animation. Retro, and very refreshing to play. Nobody is. <laughs> on top of that, there are new mini games, unlockable characters, and a story Man. mode in which Mario, Sonic, Would you, Bowser, can you believe and Doctor Egg must escape. <laughs> Nowadays we have a game that has Games, Mario Tokyo, and Sonic together. Mario and Sonic at the Olympic Games Tokyo 2020. It's so weird to see this happen. I bet you told told people way back in the fucking. 
80s, this, they wouldn't believe you. They wouldn't believe it, yeah. In the 90s, this this thing wouldn't have happened. Ah, they play the demo version. version. Uh, Damon X Machina. Demo or Demon X Machina. I've been told this has been actually really good for people, well, the people who have uh, oh, yeah. tested it. And all of your progress can carry so. over to the full game. It looks like a fun. never played a mech action game, Good old running what they're all about. This is the perfect time to take one for a test drive. Get to make your own mech in that? That's pretty cool. I don't know why. Next. The Star Wars Classic, Star Wars so classic. Fun, it's back for more. <gasps> what? I know what that game is! The New Republic is our only hope to stop a rogue Wow. Yes! I knew it! Lightsaber at the ready. That's, that's a good, that is a good game. That is a very good game. Power of the Force. Courtesy of Aspire, the full single-player experience of Star Wars. By the way, if you want to know who that is, Jedi that is, um, is coming to one of my favorite uh, Star Wars uh, protagonists uh, ever in history. That is? That is, uh, Mr. Kyle Katarn. Nice. Nice. Here's where my journey begins. Witcher. Mercenary I completed Yeah, boy. Your current contract, tracking down a living weapon known so as good. the Child of Prophecy. You'll have a whole world to explore. At home and on the go. How much content did this stuff in this game? Wild Hunt Complete Edition. Quite a bit. Nintendo Switch on October 15th. It's a very big game. And all downloadable content. Like it's ten times bigger than Skyrim. For the ride. Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag. Oh, oh. It's very fun. It's Assassin's Creed. Assassin's Hunter and Assassin's Creed Rogue. That's two action uh, games for one. Oh, Black Flag. Value. Yeah. All so the best. So pretty much one of the best ones ever. Like Touch is this the indie section? Just Dance 2020. I mean, it's no brainer. No shit. There will always be a Just Dance. Grid, auto Sport. Okay. I welcome racing games. I feel like they're dying out now. Yeah, it depends if it's uh, owned simulator. by... <laughs> really? Huh. Okay. <laughs> Nino Kuni, Wrath of the White yes. Witch. Yes! 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 NBA oh, 2K20. Good. No. Hell no. No. The Outer Worlds. Yeah, that that makes sense. Epic exclusive. Devil May Cry 2. The 40s. Right? Yeah, that's pretty good. That's Vampire. Good. Oh, Vampire. Well, no, nothing about Breath of the Animal Wild 2. <laughs> right now, Animal Crossing. Oh, okay. Okay, no, no, no. I'm okay with this. Let's see, shall we? Fucking love Animal well, Crossing. Granted, Breath of the Wild 2 is kind of in development, so just start it. Hey, Tom. Hi, Tom. Yeah, we heard about your offer. Hey, cool, we get an ad, that's awesome. Visually, it's just like the Wii game. To get into the groove of deserted island life. That looks great. It may be a deserted island, but the resident services building at its center is here to support your needs, so there's nothing to worry about. So you pretty much created it. You pretty much turned a deserted island into a home. With a variety of a phone, huh? For all your deserted island needs, yeah, that's new. So the villager character gets a phone and with apps built in. Okay. Let's that's start probably their new uh, menu world of we're system, going which to is actually pretty good. Materials. That's actually a really great idea. Oh, so you craft, so you then throw a craft we'll some stuff now. Taking some inspirations from Minecraft, no doubt. Which is pretty good. That actually works really well for Animal Crossing. That makes sense. Nicely done. I wonder if Mr. Rossetti will ever make a cameo. Or outside. Probably will. You can we still need him. We do need so him, despite him being quote-unquote fired from Animal Crossing. So. And you, can fully enjoy <laughs> you can never fire Mr. Rossetti. Life. <laughs> Just that he has no purpose now since you can't Let's reset the game. Back to resident services. He always has a purpose. <laughs> Here we sell tools and furniture. We also buy your unwanted His items, is including absolute. any weeds you remove, as part of our Whoa. island cleanup plan. Weeds? In addition <laughs> to the you can just pretty much the scenery changes grab an entire tree weather. to move it now. There will be sunshine, cloudy days, rainfall, and enough so wind to weather. shake That's the trees. Good. In oh, you play a uh, multiplayer live city there. Perfect. A local wireless or you can play all also together with all your friends in the same house. That's actually good. Island for a total of eight players in one visit. The whole scene feels meant to be. 
Why not snap a photo with everyone and make it a lasting memory? So essentially, Animal Crossing is now the real world. Pretty much. How's Deserted Island like looking? What Except way better. You here today is truly way more happy the beginning. Too. There's so much more waiting to be discovered. Man, this so game's gonna be a completion as hell, <laughs> by the way. How can you complete Animal Crossing when the game plays itself? Check a Conroy, watch a watch a good video. <laughs> okay, you did enough. a whole let's play of New Leaf. Wow. I collected every single item in the game. Wow. That's what drive you insane. <laughs> Oh. Zelda! Yeah, okay, here we go. Okay. You have it my attention. Or is this. <gasps> Wait, no, this is Xenoblade! Ah, I had a feeling it was Xenoblade. Is this the first game? Are they remaking the first game? They fucking are! I called it! Unless this is the sequel. I... No, this is, this is totally remake the first game. Remake of the first yep. game, yeah, I figured. Yeah, that makes sense. I mean, the, the music at first, I thought it was Zelda, but no, it's it's Xenoblade. Granted, I haven't I finished know. Xenoblade yet. It's so It's good. a huge game. It's massive. Sugar Conroy's number one game of all time. I'm, I'm actually really the glad that they are bringing cool. in Xenoblade Chronicles first So the game is has been technically ported in three consoles. That's it for today. Uh, the Wii, the 3DS the XL, and now the Switch. <laughs> oh, the Magic is doing demonstration. I'm sorry, I need to see this. I'm sorry, I need, I need, I need, I need Brace yourself, that Brace yourself. in my life. I need that in my life right now. I oh, need that. boy. Monster Hero Sakura is going to be playing some Banjo Kazooie. I need, Here we I need go. that right now. Hello, everyone. Yeah, boy. I'm Masahiro Sakura, my director of the Super Smash Brothers. That's Sakura. So, wait, Hersh is putting more DLC characters in Smash. When are you going to take a and break, man? You all how to use I know. It's a machine. I heard he was actually really excited like about that. He's like, he's like, he's I think he's, he said he's wanted <laughs> them in the game for many, many years. Wow. Broadcast. We sure are busy, even if I say so myself. Huh. Now that today's Nintendo Direct is over, please let me take Oh, this is right after the time. first two yeah. days, I guess. You may remember in the Hero Showcase, I was playing by myself using two controllers like this. With Hero, if you cast spells using command selection, any opposing heroes will block those attacks automatically using their shields. Huh. So, in the background, I was actually using the second controller to make the hero look away or do moves so my attacks would connect. Today I have my controllers set up side by side, Okay. but back in the GameCube days, I lined them up vertically, like this. Try doing this with the Nintendo Switch Pro controllers, however, and you'll end up accidentally pressing the L and R buttons. So, yeah. even though it's a bit of a pain, I do it like this now. That makes sense. This time around, I'll also be doing my best to control two fighters at once, kind of like Banjo and Kazooie, two characters acting as one. Alright, let's get started. So, what is Banjo Kazooie? Well, in terms of genre, it's similar to Super Mario 64, and it was first released on Nintendo 64 back in 1998. <laughs> and they say the Japanese didn't know about Banjo Kazooie. Of course they did. Of course they did. It was one of, the, was one of their that, third most highest grossing games on their console. And then, of course Banjo they did. Two titles were then released for Game Boy Advance, although they never came to Japan. And then there's Banjo Kazooie Nuts and Bolts, which was released on Xbox 360. Oh God, please don't remind we us about Nuts and Bolts. Please don't remind us about the Game Boy Advance games and Nuts and Bolts, please. Banjo Kazooie IP now belongs to Microsoft. They acknowledge it. They're like, it's currently part of Microsoft. If they would give it to us, we would obviously make another game, and then all of us would be really fucking happy. But no. Even so, they were. And yes, I'm still salty about that. The Super Smash Brothers series. Many are. For that, I'm extremely grateful. They're so like, we know they're a rival, but you know what? Who cares? We're really happy that they'd be willing to do this for us. But please, give the game a try. On Xbox. <laughs> <laughs> it, who would have thought Sucker would be promoting an Xbox game? If we were to include this yeah, I never thought that would have Well, keep in mind, Nintendo and Microsoft have a common Here. foe. Yes. So they have to work Here. together. You'll see the track names. Okay. Let's take a look at the oh, fighter. Man, do they have like? Oh man, I can't wait to point out what songs or what. I'm gonna be excited. 
Challenger Pack 3. The best yeah. character. The best so character. This is and Super Smash Brothers he looks so good! <laughs> Woo! We're using a special ROM today, so, so the camera is a bit different oh, from the production pack. He's beautiful. Their flurry attack is a rat attack rap. Their dash attack is a forward roll. That is something awesome. Donkey Kong uses as well. First and I love that their moves are, are based off their moves in the game. They're down to the original game. Bar. And two in. In Japanese, their side smash is called Harisen Kazooie. Harisen is a <laughs> I love how they made that their like Japanese, super so high side smash. This <laughs> <laughs> so the so poor, good. poor Kazooie. Yeah. You get that as an ability in the way. So this basically you just take Kazoo to smash back, which is pretty <laughs> accurate. Her, sorry. So her. smash Their attack is with you know smashing Kazoo. Okay, I get it. Yeah. It's pretty good. Wing whack. Their back air is an air rat attack. That makes sense. Rat, which hits three times. <laughs> Their down air is beat buster, which they use to yeah. stab as they drop. I love it. Hey, look, there's Grinzelda. Neutral special is egg firing. The egg shot. It's, it's pretty okay. much their go-to move. The eggs Classic. bounce. And by charging down the button when launching the eggs, you'll do the uh, you see here. I don't think they charge. Okay. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, this is a move that Rico he gains in Magic Kingdom where he takes Kazooie and turns her into a gun. It's pretty good. You can hold the button for auto fire, but as you do, the power of the egg. I actually really love the idea of that. That's such so a good idea. Careful. Nice. You can cancel it by crossing Decreases the button. Uh, that makes sense. Don't want to make them too overpowered. <laughs> their side special is Wonder Wing. Wonder Wing. As in their original game, it's an invincible charge. You know, invincibility, right? <laughs> That's the side B. It's fairly powerful and will basically win against any other attack. Has priority over most attacks. However, That's actually kind of feathers broken. above Banjo's head. There are five of them in total, and I just use up all of them. After using them up, you won't be able to use the attack again until you lose a stock. Since the remaining uses of Wonder Wing only appear above their heads, they're limited, huh? You'll really need to Until sure you lose a stock, really? Okay, head. that's that's harsh. You can use it as a recovery option. So you can't and just Wonder Wing a million times. Counter attacks. It doesn't have many disadvantages. That's actually kind of harsh. But it does have a weak point. If it's so you have to use them wisely. For instance, you'll be wide open to attack. That makes sense. In addition, you can be grabbed during this move. You think they would just recharge over time, but apparently not. At any rate, keep track of how many. But I can see why they would make that limited because it's in, it's a it's actually when fighting against Banjo and Kazooie. Make sure to take action against this attack and remember to keep an eye on it. It's important to keep this in mind. I like how the, the, and it's the bottom too. thing actually hurts also, it's, it's kind of like Sonic in the spring. Specials that carry the fight up uh, kind of! Uh, it's you're still uh, able to jump in mid after essentially what it is. It's one of the moves that they had in, in the original game. It's where they jump so on a bounce pad and they right, you right, can like make a much jump, bigger jump. And then dodge, increasing your ability to recover. Okay. By the way, the height of a shock spring jump will change depending on how long you hold There's the a pink band right there. Hmm. No, it depends like on how long you hold the button. Okay. Next, for their down yeah, we'll control, make it higher. Okay, that makes sense. They'll fire a grenade out of his backpack. It's a grenade egg. This is a slightly odd projectile in that it can only be launched behind the fighter. Huh. Oh yeah, the pooping eggs. <laughs> they decided to make grenade eggs. Nice. Grenade eggs. That's kind of it's football shape. It's kind of weird. It's bouncy trajectory. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> there it is, the classic. After a certain time, it will explode. I think it will be a useful tool for keeping opponents in check. It's treated like an item, so you can pick it up and throw it. Oh, nice. So it's kind of like a... Kind of like the, uh, almost, almost in a similar way to when Link uses the, the bomb. But its detonation sequence is yeah. relatively short. So both Which makes sense. your opponents will need to make sure you throw it quickly or it will explode while you're still holding it. Fair I enough. guess there are a lot of different ways to use this ability. He's so good. He's so final good. smash is the mighty ginger. Yeah, the fucking ginger is what delivered the final blow to Brenda Love it. in their original game. Oh. This move will send your opponents flying. Go on. Spiral nothing. 
This stage is called Kirikuriyama in Japan, but in the west it's called Spiral Mountain. As you can see, it's a mountain where the bottom portion is spiral shape. A rotation icon. You see Banjo's there. house in the corner there. So I guess the uh, the camera rotates on occasion. This is not quite not unusual, not entirely for the Super Smash Brothers series. That makes sense. It's truly unique. You and really get to see all the Spiral Mountain. Oh, oh the they even put uh, the shape of they even put um, well, a honeycomb pieces in that and like the tree in that just so they see it. That's actually really cool. Nice attention to detail there. There's Mumbo. Platforms like Bottles. this will appear from time to time. A bridge will also appear when Gluntilda's lair is visible. This time, I'll be taking on not just... Oh, is Sakurai gonna play oh, against somebody? Oh. Donkey Kong and Diddy Kong versus Banjo. It's fitting that they make a play to... Uh, Hang on, Donkey so there Kong. are actually two on my side too, Kong. so I should be fine, right? Probably not. In fact, definitely not. Looks like I'm gonna get beaten up pretty bad if I just stand around. So I'll play carefully. I fucking love it. Two on one. Okay. I should probably keep them in check. You Your tell Sakura I just fired forward and backward all right now. times like this. And thanks to Kazooie, Banjo and Kazooie can use moves with a relatively wide range of attack. We'll make good use of these as we take them on. Oh man! I swear, Sakura has raised the bar so high. Items on. I don't know what he's gonna do for the next Smash game. I don't think there is going to be another Smash game after this. I have two opponents, and since items are on, they'll have twice How is he going to toss me? It's not four DLC characters to toss me. People thought it was just going to be five, but no, he's like, no, for that, I'm making more. It's the game that keeps on giving, man. It's amazing. It really is. Who's next? I can use one of them two more times. Gino? Because everybody wants Gino. He'll probably cave in and say, alright, fine. Oops, You're like, I guess fine. I should be Here's your f***ing. <laughs> Ouchies. Oh, I mean, oh, everyone, wants it. You can have that. Everyone wants them. Now. And people wanted K. Rule. We got him. If they wanted Ridley. We got him. They wanted Bayonetta. We got him. Oh, you can hit opponent, multiple people with that, by the way. Nice. Ginginator, that's gonna be some garbage. <laughs> I do want to use a final smash, but it might be a bit tough. I love oh, it. That's good. He's my favorite. And, and yes, he's gonna be smash. one of my mains. <laughs> I forced him out, so I win. He's gotta be a main. Banjo picks up a jiggy from the original yeah. game. Go! <laughs> That's yeah, right. yeah, you two look Banjo great. getting jiggy with it. <laughs> you know what I mean. De Damn straight. I'd also like to talk about some of the cameos that liven up the stage. Do we need the song well, back? We have the witch from Tilda. ACDC <laughs> playing. In Banjo Kazooie. That's that's literally what we need right underground now. By a boulder. <laughs> does she say stupid rhymes on the side of the screen? That would be This is bottles. A mold. I wouldn't be surprised if he does. Poor soul. His that would be hilarious. It's bottles. They're like poor soul. Yeah, he freaking died in Banjo too. Next is Mumbo Jumbo. Poor guy. This poor soul had all of his Mumbo toys like, stolen. Like Grunto just Gruntilla. zapped the <laughs> out of Banjo's house with in many he ways and he died. throughout the game. Spotter? Uh, She's she? running at the bottom. Really? She's tiny and can barely even make her out. Wow. But by I didn't even in, see that properly. You can see all the detail. Even at her size. You could probably make an action game just using this. Hi, Tootie. She's raising havoc on the vegetable path for some reason. Getting captured by Gruntilda again. That's actually really and cool that they're that, playing that much detail. enigmatic taunt. That's neat. Now she's heading back home. She looks all calm when you look at her this way, but this soul is actually the saddest of all the souls. You'd understand how miserable she really is if you saw the game over scene in Banjo Kazooie. I guarantee you, KZX, KZX, and then we're gonna be playing this right now. Here come the Jinjos. We saw some of these a short while ago. When the oh, there's Jinjos. That's actually really cool looking. Colors and were hidden throughout that the is awesome. Like in the original game. Those are all the so uh, colors that they're also in the original game. Souls. Oh yeah, now, what songs you put in this game? I'm excited. As I mentioned, Gobi's Valley, we're yeah, taking boy. country style music and adapting it for use in battle. 
We're including a total of 10 music tracks. 10 tracks. Of these, 7 are entirely new tracks. I'm okay with 10 tracks. I've always thought that getting all this for 5 99 is a fantastic deal. So, I hope you enjoy it. All that for 6 bucks. Yeah, it's a steal. The music for Spiral Mountain was a good Let's get six bucks worth it, man. He created the original Banjo Kazooie's music. Ah, good old Grant. He's probably really excited that he's being talked about right now. I've worked with many musicians over the years, but this is the first time I've worked with a musician outside of Japan. Wow. I was a bit worried about whether my directions would be understood. The first time outside of Japan. But he did an absolutely wonderful job. And here's the list of tracks this time. Each of the new tracks has been carefully tailored to match the action. Of course he would do an absolute, absolute job. Nice. Which will pretty game much mode. be our final new mode. Ooh, I'm going to go ahead and play, so please take a look. <laughs> what have you done, Sakurai? You need to damage oh! Oh, home run contest! Brought back the, they brought back the sack. <laughs> and with this bat, not with this, I heard you guys but this bat, me. and off it goes. He brought back the sad sack. Maybe a little too high. The sack is in space and now! So, oh god, he actually is. Contest makes its return. He it's said that thing flies! ...compared to previous home run contests, so please enjoy. Cool. Look how kawaii I am, I got little blush kilometers. marks. I think that's about the distance from Tokyo to Nagoya. That's if you drive on the Tomei. Should we have the, the, yeah, wow. sack, as, we have the sack as a you smash character? That would be great. Player. Yeah, but what would his attacks be, though? He throws other Let's sacks at other go. people. Attack, attack, keep attacking using both players. Oh, you could do it with two people, too. That's awesome. Time to strike. Boom. Here we go. No. Oh, this isn't how you're supposed to play the game. When I say two players can take part, I mean friends can play together, and not one person playing as two fighters. That takes master skill. I hope you play this with your friends. If a sack comes fly out of nowhere and hits sack right in the face, I'm going to laugh my ass off. In shared content, many people upload the fighters as fighters. Yeah, we have been a little difficult to use since you were not able to customize their special moves. But moving forward, you will be able to freely customize their special moves. If you find a new oh, you can find this. Oh, okay, they, okay, they oh, fixed the level. Okay. And set the special moves however you want and play as them. However, this will not be applied to new fighters created in the Blabo version. And only applies to I'm gonna beat you with this cardboard. So I hope you re-upload your Mii Fighters. Please enjoy many different varieties of oh, Mii Fighters. Man. We will add in some Mii Fighter costumes as well. Please take a look. Oh, they have more costumes. Did you put some stuff for, for Banjo Kazooie Mii Fighter stuff? Let's see. Ah, go on. Mark. Oh, that's awesome! Mystical Ninja! Wow, that's actually really cool that they're actually willing to acknowledge that game franchise. That game Mega franchise. Mega Man! Effect. What do we have? Proto Man, okay. Yeah, that makes sense. That could be good. Or Gunner. That makes sense. Mega Man X! And we have Zero! Finally! The man's time to shine. Mega Man Zero? Pokemon. And it's. Team Rocket! Yeah! Nice! <laughs> That's pretty good. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. People would want that. What?! <laughs> Son of a. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it! I knew it! Give me coming to you! Talk about getting crap past the I radar! Was son saying, of a! In some way, some way, that he was gonna show up in this game in some form. Well, he pulled a fast one on us. I knew it. <laughs> I knew it. <laughs>
Sakurai, I salute you, but dude, take a break! <laughs> uh, I knew it. That's pretty good. We got a costume for Sans. People are gonna be really pissed off with that. Oh god. Oh god, the Undertale haters are gonna be so triggered. They're gonna be like, be why wasn't he a DLC character? So that's what's gonna happen. That's what they're gonna say. <laughs> the arrangement was made by none other than the creator of Undertale himself, Toby Fox. Man, Toby Fox really has made a name wow. for himself when he's carrying his fucking wow. Nintendo. That's gonna trigger so many people who hate Undertale, by the way. <laughs> they're just gonna see people with Sans and they're like, I hate you. <laughs> I love it. Next, I'd like to talk about a new set of amiibo that will soon be available. Squirtle. Here's a Squirtle amiibo. Oh, it's my man. So are you still going to be Squirtle or are you going to be Banjo now? And Snake. Don't make the don't make me choose, <laughs> damn it. They will each be available. I refuse to make that decision. Oh, there's a Snake amiibo. The software update, including the Banjo and Kazooie DLC, will be available today. It's my favorite Pokemon. God, we went past like the seven. It's already seven oh one. Bring it on, Terry. As mentioned, in <laughs> there's Nintendo Terry. Track, there's your Terry. Terry Bogart will be joining Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. Although we showed the reveal trailer, there was hardly any in-game footage. Some time. of you may wonder where the in-game footage is. Absolutely, but take all the f time you need. But we weren't quite ready to include it in the reveal. That SNK Neo Geo opening was fun, wasn't it? Oh yeah. It's actually nice to have the representation of Neo Geo, uh, by the way. It is really great. Okay! Oh, look at how good he looks. He's got Fatal Fury on his hat. The knuckle! Nice! <laughs> all the footage they have so far, it's understandable. It was announced that we will be working yeah. with even more DLC fighters. <laughs> to me, it feels like the fish might be <laughs> sliding like, farther away. <laughs> You may wonder, how much longer can he be involved <laughs> in Super Smash Bros. Life. Ultimate? <laughs> but I'm also excited. Adding more characters into the game means that more game worlds will be added to the series. Oh, wow. And ultimately, that means that there will be an even greater opportunity to delight really? the fans. At the same time, I feel that Super Smash Bros. Ultimate is now representing so, so when's Chrono Trigger gonna be in the game? game world, that it's become an enormous <laughs> game. Right now, anything is possible. Or Sora. The Super Smash King of Hearts. Continues moving forward, People will want that. Will ever Bad, be an opportunity dude. To bring this many characters together again. And so, I want to keep improving on this record as much as possible. And I will continue I can see why he wants to do it. Yeah, he wants to bring every character he possibly can. Because he might never get the chance to ever do something like this ever again. That's it for today. Thank you very much. You got our support, Sakurai. You always have our support. I don't even know who's next now. Who's going to be next for wow. Smash? Wow. Like, they're like, oh, we have one more DLC character. Oh, no, we're kidding. We have like 15 or 13 or 30 Son more characters coming. Oh, God. How many? Who else are they going to add? I don't even know anymore. Oh man, I never thought Nintendo would actually bring their A game. Like, finally, they're doing something right. Like, you know who I think they'll probably add? They might add a character from Tales of Symphonia or whatever. <laughs> That's one of the rumors. Probably one of those characters. Oh god, the, the possibilities for video games are oh, endless. Man.